Hello, it's Justin here, and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video. And uh, today, uh, I want to do something um, a little bit different. Uh, you can see that we're in a different flat world again. And basically, um, yeah, I want to do something a little bit slightly different. Uh, I've been thinking about it for quite a while. And um, do you know my um, yeah, do you know my uh, my series? Uh, what I do on a um, uh, on a normal world. Uh, do you know that series? What I do on the PC version. Uh, this is going to be exactly the same as that one, which is going to be on the flat world. Uh, so it, it is going to be like exactly the same, uh, but I thought we can uh, we can do it a lot bit different. So uh, yeah, uh, the block I chose um, is um, the block that you find at um, uh, uh, mycelium. Uh, that's it. I nearly forgot the word. Uh, yeah, I've got, uh, yeah, I've actually chose that block uh, because basically what I want to do at some point is I know that I want to do a lot of series on Minecraft uh, aimed on a flat world. Is because basically since in Minecraft have so many blocks now um, on the um, yeah, on the uh, on the console versions, uh, I want to basically like use all the blocks for a flat world. I know that uh, there's like so many Minecraft ideas that I've got for flat worlds, but at the moment though, there'll be some that I can't think of, so that'll be a really good idea. But yeah, uh, yeah, you can see I, I chose that, and right underneath it, uh, there is uh, I think there's coaster. Is it coaster or is it po or is it ponza? Um, I'm, I'm actually not sure, but wait, I can. Uh, aha, here we go, yeah. You can see there's Ponzo underneath it. And then I think underneath that, it's, yeah, it's bedrock. Okay, so yeah. Uh, I basically decided to not make a, um, a deep plumber for this world. Uh, just because we're, uh, we don't need to have as many blocks. So, um, yeah, I've kind, kind, of kind of ruined the pattern now. And so I'll just go and uh, put, it, put it back here. Okay, I'm kind of like ruining the pattern. There we go. There we go, perfect. Okay, so uh, I thought that today we can go and... Trade with villagers with some rotten flesh today. Um, just because that while I've been trading, I've not been having as much rotten flesh. So I thought in this video of today we can go and do some simple trading with some rotten flesh and see how much we get. So we're going to go and do that. Um, because I know that in this world I will be building some stuff as well. Uh, so I won't be doing like random things for today. But uh, the, uh, the reason I'm, we're doing this one is because this is the first thing I thought of to do. Uh, since I found the village. So I thought we can go and do that. But the first thing I want to do is I just want to go and look at these blacksmiths and see what we've got in here. Because I always like to look in blacksmiths all the time. So let's go and have a look in here. Okay, I looked and we got, oh, got some good things. I'll go and take these. Because the thing that I always do, by the way. Is I always keep breaking the chest when I'm in here. It's just because that I'm in creative, so I just like to break one. Is there another blacksmith? Aha! Yes, there is one. Yeah, there's not. I think, I think there's like two at villages, and sometimes I don't. Looks like I got another one. Um, so yeah, I thought that, uh, that today we could go and do some simple. Um, yeah. Oh, bloody hell. <laughs> I knew that was going to happen at some point. Yeah, uh, I thought that today we can go and. Um, yeah, go and do, do uh, so yeah, so simple trading with the village as well. It's only rotten flesh trading, I should say, so I thought we can just go and do that. Uh, there is a village over there, but I'm not going to put my head to that one. I'm just going to stay at, uh, at, at this one. Uh, so there is a few villagers that do need rotten flesh and some that don't. Um, so let's go and start off with the scientists. So these go, uh, no, nope, okay, so he needs paper, so I can't do him. Uh, so uh, I can only do the guys. That I've only got rotten flesh, and uh, if I'm going to be pretty, pretty lucky, I should be fine. If you've got rotten flesh for me, oh, you have. Okay, so I can give you that emerald. There you go. Perfect. Right, so that's my first training done, and I managed to get my first emerald, uh, because I want to try and get a few emeralds today, and I want to want to actually run out of ro uh, rotten flesh. I can't have any more, and I'm going to put this in survival actually, just because I don't want to get any more uh, rotten flesh from um. From creative, because I won't be doing this series in survival, creative, and adventure. Like I said, it's going to be one of them uh, other ones. Okay, so do you need a uh, do you need wrong flesh? Aha, you do, don't you? Oh, you need forty. Okay, I'll give you that. There you go. Thank you very much. And we've only oh my god, we've only got fifty one left now. <laughs> got two emeralds, and we've only got fifty one rotten flesh. Well, there is a lot. Oh, this piece of bread here. Don't mind if I grab that. Yeah, because basically one thing I've noticed is like the villagers, like they always want uh, rotten flesh for some reason. I know that there's kind of like a lot of people, a lot of um, villagers out there that don't want rotten flesh, but there's kind of a lot that do want them, so that's fine. So we've got 51 right now, and I don't want to bother wasting it. So I'm gonna go and have a look at, have a look at the other ones. Uh, so he needs he needs uh, raw food. Uh, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna grab that because we've got no animals. Uh, apart from apart from you can see slime, like that's basically only like that's basically only the thing you're going to find on this world, just slime. Because basically one thing I've noticed about creating these super flat worlds is there's only slime on them, uh, because slime are absolutely everywhere. When you when you 
when you see slime, like, around the place around the world, there's, like, there's loads of it absolutely everywhere. And it's just pretty incredible, like, there's just so much everywhere, yet you just basically just don't know what to find from them, like, it's just absolutely everywhere. And actually, uh, this, uh, this uh, by the way, the next uh, video I'm going to be making is going to be something on slime, is why I'm going to be killing a whole lot of slime in a fart world, so that'll be coming up. Let's make sure we're on stick with that coming. Okay, so let's go a little bit more deep down. So you want 38 rotten flesh. Uh, you want 36. You want 37. Okay, so so these three villagers want rotten flesh. But at the moment though, which one shall I go for? And he wants 38 as well. So I've got a choice between all of them. And uh, he wants 36. So I've got a choice between these four pink villagers. Like, which one shall I go for with a good trade? Um, what about this one? Does, does this one need a lot? Let's have a look at this one. You need 36 as well. Jesus Christ, how much bloody rotten flesh do you need? You're not going to bloody eat it, are you? Okay, so which one should I go for? You guys having a bit of a conversation. Okay, so should I go for the 37 or the 38? I think it's got to be the 36, because that means I've got a little bit more left. So yeah, I'm going to go for the 36, so I think I should have about 10 left or 15. 15 left. Okay, there we go. Oh, that was great maps, wasn't it? So there we are. So we've got 15 left now. So that is now three emeralds in this video. Wow, we've uh, managed to get a lot, haven't we? Because I think in the, in the next video, I'm going to do some more trading again. Um, but basically, I'm going to have a different thing on them this time. Because what, what else can you trade with, by the way? Oh, it's paper. Um, I can't remember what else. Wait, do you trade with, like, food as well? Okay, so you get coal as well. So I might be able to do some coal trading as well. So, so that'll be very, very handy. Because I think in the next video I might do some more trading as well. I might do like paper and coal around maybe. Or something. So I think there's many villagers that don't have coal and, and paper. So that's going to be a lot bit of a worrying one. But that should be completely fine. So can we do any more? Okay, so you want 37. Okay, so the scientist guys, they need paper. So that'll be for the next video. Um, how much do you need? You need 38. Um, does anyone need 15 rotten flesh? Okay, no, you want 37. Okay, I'm just going to check every single pink villager. Uh, no, you want 36. I actually don't think we can actually do any more trading. Um, is, that, is there any in here? Nope. Okay, none in there. I actually don't think there's actually any more around here. And, you, and you, guys get, you guys get to your houses, it's getting dark. Get to your houses. It's getting dark, you don't want Google is bloody eating you. Because I promise I don't want the bloody uh, Google is eating you. Well, I should say. I should do that, I should say. I'll change the daytime to keep my health for you guys. Oh, oh, someone's farming. Oh, they're farming. Look, look at them. They're farming some crops. They are farming the crops. Look at all these pink villagers over here. <laughs> they're like all in a row here. But I know that I don't need all. Hang on. Hang on a minute. What are these old? So you need gold. Okay, so there's some of them that need gold and some need rotten flesh. I don't think I can do any more. I've kind of would like check them all now. I kind of would just check them all now. Like I don't want to bother like trading my emeralds because otherwise I would have got different things. So, I, like I, that, that's the thing that I didn't want to do. By the way, I didn't want to um basically just trade my um my emeralds. In, otherwise, it, it just would have not worked. So I just didn't want to bother doing that. I actually don't think we can actually do any more though. Um. Oh, oh, we can here. Uh, so we can do uh, lapis and redstone, but like I said, I don't want to waste my emeralds, so I'm not going to bother with that trade. Okay, so you guys need a lot and a lot, a lot of rotten flesh. Well, I've got 15 left anyway, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to store this in the blacksmiths. I'm going to store this in at the blacksmiths and see what I can find in it. Okay, I'll tell you what, I'm going to... Are you hiding, sir? Yeah, I'm going to go and store it in, uh, in here to make it proper cool. Actually, I'll tell you what, I'll just store it in there. It would be, be, be way easier just... And just getting myself a chest. But overall though, I managed to do uh, a couple of trades, not not a lot of trades altogether, but trading with rotten flesh is not too bad. Like I know that like there's a lot of villages out there that want a lot and stuff like that. But I just kind of I just wanted to just show what it's like basically. I just wanted to just let you all know and just kind of I just let you know how the trading works for that one and it's so pretty simple to be honest. But I just wanted to just see how it works and uh, it, to be honest with you, it's not even that easy to be able to trade with the um with the rotten flesh well it's not even that hard anyway but overall though it's uh, pretty, pretty cool so uh, so i think what i'm going to do in the next video is i'm going to do the same again but uh, i'm going to do uh, coal and paper uh, for the next one because basically i might be able to get a lot of trades with that 
So if I get about like three, three sacks of coal and three stacks of paper, um, I'll be able to uh, yeah get a lot from there. So that's what I want to do by the way. And then yeah, so that'll be next. Um, I think the most the most people oh, oh 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 my god oh my goodness mate. Okay, yes, yeah, so I will be uh, going to a lot and a lot a lot of the scientist people. I will be going to a whole lot of those. So yeah, there will be a lot of those that I will be going to. So that'll be. That'll be fine, I'll be able to get to a lot of those. Um, and uh, yeah, apart from that though, I think it should be uh, absolutely fine. Well, it should, it should not be, uh, it should not be uh, too bad to be honest, but I think it, it should be okay with, uh, with a lot more slightly training. So I think with paper, I believe you do get, you probably will get a lot more training with that as well. So hopefully that will, um, yeah, that will, uh, that will happen. But yeah, that's kind of like uh, everything uh, for today's video. I just wanted to do a little video and just kind of uh, just explaining of actually how training works with Rotten Flesh. But it looks like it doesn't happen uh, altogether. But um, yeah, the training with, with it is still a very, very good thing. So hopefully you guys have really enjoyed. So when I come back again, I will do another trade. And this time I'll do uh, the coal and the paper and have loads of those. But hopefully that'll be really good. But yeah, I'll play some more these videos in this world coming up very soon on Minecraft. So yeah, I will see you. Later. Bye.